for the kids, we have a new Sing and Dance Mickey. For our adults, we have our Apple iPad. Retail managers like Target's Alan Wise are gearing up for a big holiday shopping day. Black Friday, we're probably looking about 14 or 15,000 people. Walking through these doors alone, and while Wise is preparing for the crowd, making sure shelves are stocked with the latest toys and gadgets, others are making plans too. The criminals are uh, uh, just as smart as we are. Uh, they're getting their game plan together as well, and they put plan for they plan for Black Friday just as well as we do. And according to crime prevention security expert Tyrone Lewis, they have new targets this year. Your little ones don't give kids money. That they don't uh, give kids bags to carry as well. Uh, because they are going to be the most vulnerable uh, individuals in, when it comes to the holiday season. According to Lewis, children sometimes carry money in their jean pockets or coats, and sometimes a small tip of the cash is visible. And children usually never have a tight grip on shopping bags, so thieves grab and go. And ladies, we know to keep a tight grip on our purses. But if it slips your mind and you decide to let it dangle, especially when you're going through an automatic or revolving door. Criminals watch that and they time it and they come around and once they sling to a certain way, they snatch it and keep on running. We sat and watched several women go in and out of stores just to see how alert they were when shopping. We're doing safety prevention tips and we see that your purse is hanging off your shoulder and our good Crime prevention officer here says that you are carrying your purse the wrong way. I sure am. I will not deny that. Now, what else should she have done? What about the way she was carrying her bag? I was concerned about the way she was carrying her bags, uh, the items that she just purchased. I, I would love to have seen her to carry both bags in the same hand. And men, you aren't exempt either. Make sure you carry your wallet in your front pocket. Uh, be careful of pickpocketers. Here's the bottom line. Have a plan. Know exactly where you're going. Don't shop alone. Carry very little cash. And this is very important. Make eye contact. Look people in the eyes. That makes them afraid of you because they don't want to be identified. And you don't want to be identified as a victim. Katina Rankin, WLBT News.